Hello YouTube, this is 2T. This is YouTube in a month for January. apologize for the lateness of this video and the poor lighting uh, we had some severe technical difficulties which have now overcome and all is well in the universe balance has been restored so to speak so this is it this is the final one from me I'm not gonna bang on too much about it because I've ramped it up to the nth degree anyway but suffice to sort of say after this one whomever should win YouTube of the year and anybody that has been nominated previously in the last sort of 12 episodes Please, please, please go and check your um, private messages in uh, on Google or, or YouTube. You will have been messaged there from me. Uh, essentially, I just need a two-minute video from yourselves. Um, details are in there. I'm struggling to get um, communication with the people, so I'm having to probably use this video a little bit to sort of garner some leverage. I do apologise for that. Um, yeah, so time's of the essence, essentially. Anyway, put that to one side. This is YouTube of the month, yeah, 5 of January. And I think it's fair to say, relatively, you know, smallish unknown uh, channels that were put forward by my gamer XP. Wonderful channels out. I hope you went and checked those out, as I always, uh, you know, encourage everybody to do so. But, as is always the case, there can only be one winner. And we did have a clear winner, thank God, <laughs> none of the double, uh, you know, double dibbler. It was only one, and uh, that winner. everyone um a big thank you i guess is in order for voting me your youtuber of the month for january 2016. uh big thanks to matt and my gamer xp for nominating me in the first place uh sorry to the other guys who won shambles you would have been in one of my votes now to be a top youtuber so sorry you didn't get it or sorry to the other guys too and a big big thank you to 2t uk for actually hosting all of this and setting these things up i think it's a really cool initiative and it's a nice way to find out about other youtubers so aces thank you both so, um, I'm going to be very quick with this because this video is late, uh, because if you can't tell by my wonderful little tin tones, I'm completely man flued up to my eyeballs. So, I will nominate my five candidates for the month of February 2016, and they are... Actually, the first one you may actually probably know uh, from his main channel, uh, which is Banjo Guy Ollie. Um, however, I'm not going to vote for that one, even though you should check that out if you haven't already, because that one's got a lot of subscribers as it is. But I'm actually going to nominate his second Charlie with channel, Charlie, which is just called Ollie. And I think this is a really nice channel. It's Ollie playing through games and talking over them like many other YouTubers do, but he's a very nice chap and it's very nice to listen to his wonderful tones and he also does some other pickup videos which i quite like and he also does uh, videos with a dog called simon uh, which is some of my favorite things to watch when they come up in my subscriptions so you should go bother him to do some more of those next up is a channel i really really like called get bant uh, it's two people on there, uh, Lloyd and Lisa, who are both seem like very lovely people, who are pretty much doing the same. You'll notice there's a theme going through my nominations for the most part that I really like personalities in my videos and I like people talking and I like engaging with those people in comments and stuff. And I think these are all YouTubers that are very engaging with their fans and community and all of this jazz. But uh, Lloyd and Lisa are very good people. Get banned to go watch it. They do Let's Plays, they do drinking beers and stuff occasionally and yeah it's pretty fun to watch it's pretty funny viewing to be honest i quite like them as people so go check them out you can also check out it's a pixel thing uh which is a guy called pedro from portugal and the reason i'm picking this channel is because he tends to cover a lot of 80s and 90s things uh consoles that i really like but also he does great top 10 videos and some other stuff like Amiga and things that I'm not really that clued up on. So it's really nice to fill my gaps in my knowledge like that. 
Uh, next up uh, is one actually YouTuber who I want you to hassle to make more videos. There were a few of these. Uh, there was Krishant, there was also uh, Retro Game, uh, which is a massive damage. But the YouTuber I've actually picked for you to go and hassle the most, who is my fourth nomination, is uh, Stu, uh, Ninja Bear Hug. A lot of my viewers will already know him uh, because he's probably sent a lot of you in my direction. Uh, again, very nice guy. I like his Let's Plays of Game Boy Games. His Chase HQ video has made me laugh countless times at his opinions on that game. Uh, I still need to cover it, but yeah. Go hassle Stu into making more videos. I think his last one was like six months ago. So you should go do that. And then the last nomination is a bit of an oddball one. Um, it's actually for a French YouTuber, uh, Jib, as he's called on the old Twitter, and is his comic pseudonym as well, is responsible for a YouTube channel called PocketFighter.fr. And what this is, is an extremely high production value uh, series of Game Boy fighting videos. Unfortunately, they're all in French. However, I... If you are like me and unable to speak French, you can look at these videos and go, wow, these are really something really fucking cool. Uh, they actually put my own production values to shame, to be honest with you. So you should go over there, you should check out his channel. Uh, if you don't speak French, he also posts a lot of uh, YouTube adverts and trailers and stuff for games from the 90s, which you can enjoy regardless of your spoken language preferences. But you should go over there and hassle him and say, hey, you should either make these in English or you should add some English subtitles so we can all watch along. They're very, very cool episodes and you should go do that. Okay, um, that's it from me. Uh, if you like my channel and were one of the people who voted for me, thank you very much. I will be doing a sequence this month uh, called Japanuary, uh, where I'm going to look at some Japanese exclusive Game Boy games that never made it to US or European shores. But until then, Game Boys and Girls, game there on. You go. Thank you again. Congratulations to Game Boy or Matt. Absolutely brilliant. And uh, yeah, there's some great nominations in there. I think one sort of stands out that I know of, and uh, it'd be great to see that that man back on the back on the tubes. And there's four of us yet again. I've not heard of, I will be going to check those channels out, especially not the one that mentions uh, drinking beers. <laughs> That's definitely not my street. So, as I always say, and for the final time, if you've been nominated, please do a video or whatever, you know, to, to get your user base, your fan base, whatever you want to call it, uh, out there to know that you've been nominated. Obviously, don't direct them to my channel because it won't be on my channel, it'll be on whomever. Um, you know, is, is, is crowned king or queen or whatever of uh, YouTube of the year. Uh, equally, Matt Gameball probably just uh, drop said channels a note to sort of say that they've been nominated so they're aware. And hopefully, uh, all things being equal, there'll, there'll be it'll be like a uh, what do you call it, a relay, and the pattern, the pattern, the baton will be passed over. Just a couple of words from myself. I hope you don't mind. Just wanted to sort of say a massive thank you to everybody that's, that's been involved, everyone that's done videos. Everyone's commented, shared, liked, uh, subscribed, etc. Uh, I hope some of the people that subscribe stick around. If not, fully understand. And I do hope that you stick with this wherever it may go, you know, wherever it finds its new home, and uh, give them all the support that you've given me. I've really enjoyed it. Honestly, I really have. It's been it's been a great blast, and it's exposed you know a lot of good channels to the wider community. So, for the final time, take it easy, YouTube, and I'll speak to you soon. Bye bye.